West Virginia Department of Transportation is stepping in with its planning expertise to correct a long-standing drainage problem in the community of Rand. Beyond the scope of work typically performed by West Virginia Department of Transportation, the agency is taking on this unique set of problems with enthusiasm. The flooding that has long impacted the town also impacts the accessibility and maintenance of the roads. We looked on a map and said there ought to be a way to find a pipe here and there wasn't so we started poking in the ground and digging and, and we found it. Then once we got in there it's like well how are we going to look you know we don't have any guys that are small enough to crawl in this 12 inch pipe so we had a camera remote control camera that could go through there but there were places where it was blocked so they also brought in a vacuum truck. Ironically the uh, exploration actually made some improvements you know just trying to get these pipes open enough to figure out where they were and which direction they flowed um, actually did open some blockages and make a few minor improvements. It's going to be a big project, you know, 10, 12 million dollars to complete all the work. And so it's not something we can just snap our fingers and, and make happen. There are a lot of moving parts here, you know, sewer systems that intersect with the drainage system, utilities, private property issues. We own the streets, but we don't own the alleys. And of course, all the residences are private property as well. Property owners, you know, we want to be respectful here. Hopefully that will go well because I, I feel like the community is behind the project. The community wants this improvement, which will improve their quality of life. So I think we'll have cooperation there, but obviously people are always skeptical of, of the government. West Virginia Department of Transportation is pleased to lend its expertise to this complicated problem. Mm -hmm.